Hi and welcome back to the channel and thank you so much for clicking into this video. So in this video, I am going to teach you how to fix you must assign a manager located in the lower right of the screen error on the EAFC24. So make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you don't miss any important step or information. And without further ado, let's get on it. So the first fix that you can try to do is to check the manager assignment. So just the first step is to ensure that the manager is indeed assigned to your team. So navigate to your squad screen and just confirm that a manager is present and correctly slotted in. So to do this, just go to the ultimate team mode from the main menu and then navigate to the squad tab. So just check the lower right corner of the screen to see if a manager is present. And if not, just select the manager slot and choose a manager from your club to assign and then if this process doesn't work what you can do next is to use a different manager so again if the issue persists just try swapping out your current manager for a different one so it could be that the game is not registering the manager correctly and changing to a different manager might so resolve this so to do that just open your eafc24 ultimate team and tap onto the club and tap onto the squad and within the squad tab just select your current manager and choose swap manager from the options just select a different manager from your club and just confirm the change and then lastly, what you can do is to squ is a squad deletion and reassignment. So sometimes the glitch might be with the squad rather than the manager. So considering deleting your current active squad and creating a new one, then assign a manager to see if the message disappears. And to do that, just again open your EAFC24 and then tap on open settings and click on edit teams and still in the squad tab just go to the squad actions by pressing the appropriate button so this varies by platform but it's often indicated on the screen and after that just select the lead squad or reset all squad and confirm the deletion or reset and after deleting just choose create new squad and build your squad again and don't forget to assign a manager as you did in step one and so that's it for this video. Remember, you can always pause this video or go back to the video and follow the steps at your own time. And I hope this helped you. And if it did, please make sure to like, subscribe, and hit notification bell button so you don't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.